This review is Valrona's 71% uh, Le Noir Amer, or Dark Bittersweet Chocolate. And uh, this is made in France. Um, in addition to that, um, it's not clear from the ingredients whether or not this has milk in it. It was made in a facility that uses milk. It lists milk, but after a period, after a list of ingredients with commas after them. So, it seems to me like they're suggesting that there may be milk in it because it was made in a facility that processes milk, um, or uses milk. Now, they, they have identified the beans of having come from Trinitario and Criollo, um, which I believe would be somewhere in South America. Um, however, aside from that, there's nothing remarkable. No non-GMO, gluten-free, um, anything else like that. Nutrition facts and ingredients are right there. I'm kind of excited because, you know, there aren't a lot... Well, I did not find very many chocolates from France. It seemed like there were a lot from the from Belgium and, and Germany, but from France it did not seem that there were very many. So, curious and hopeful. I mean, they're very snobby about their food, which, granted, some of their food is very complicated. And again, you can say the same of a lot of Indonesian food. There's a lot of very complicated recipes in Indonesia and some really delicious food. And yes, just like in France, some people there will eat escargot or snails. Okay. Now, I've, there's nothing like remarkable about the, the chocolate as far as the mold is concerned. It's just got this plain pattern. There's a slight fruitiness to it, sourness, mildly sweet. A little bit bitter. This is very good actually. It's very different from um, the other ones in this category that taste like chocolate in terms of, it really attempts to capture the essence of chocolate without a lot of other um, flavors to it. So like, whereas with um, per Perugina Italia or CB Stuffer or some of the other ones, um, they have just a, a flat, plain chocolate flavor and then there's like Pasha and um, Sharpened burger and stuff that have fruity overtones. This just seems to be primarily chocolate with sweet and sour and bitter, um, but mildly so. Um, so it's very nice actually. Um, I would give this an eight and a half. In fact, I'm having another piece. Hmm. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.